figure of G major, G major in its first position, played with not only the index finger, but also with the middle finger. We're then going to start to apply the bar. The bar is always going to be applied with the index finger. So then we're going to make use of the middle finger to play the third string and the ring finger to play the first string. Right over here we can play C major and D major. All of these can be found along the length of the cuatro as we have seen in other figures as well. Keeping one finger open, or in the case of G major, two fingers open, also allows us to start playing different notes and including them to enrich the, the different chords and notes that we're playing. Similarly, if we're applying the bar, we're always going to have a couple of fingers open so that we can play around with them. In this case, this is D major. So we're applying the pinky to that would be one fret after the last finger and this would be on the third string in this case. Similarly with C, C major. Very nice effect, especially if we're trying to enrich the piece that we're playing.